Q&A section from now because people have been asking me too many questions and people have been asking me too many times to do Q&A. And um, okay, uh, I'm gonna go over some of the most frequently asked questions first. Uh, number one question is, Frank, how tall are you? What is your height? Well, I listed in my training mixtape is five, eight, and seven uh, and three quarters. Um, I'm actually closer to five ten. The reason why I listed myself as five eight and three quarters is because uh, when I was in my teens and early twenties, I used to uh, have this obsession with short black people who can dunk. So my dream is not to be able to dunk, right? My dream is not just dunking. My dream is to be able to dunk under 5'9". That was what I consider to be the epiphany, or the, the, apex, or the apex of human accomplishment. So I actually, uh, that leads to, so, okay, continue. Um, so what I did was I, I actually wanted to start my growth on purpose. Um, in high school, I, been in the college, I used to do a lot of calf races because my ignorant mind felt that if you do calf races when you're still uh, growing, uh, with your, still, your body's still maturing, you'll eventually stunt your growth. So it might have worked. I might have, I'm, I actually might have become like, I could have been like 5'11 right now if I didn't do all those calf races and mentally try to shrink myself so I could be a short man who could dunk. And, um, and then there was Tom Cruise, you know, I look at Tom Cruise and I'm like, he's fast and he's short and he, he's got the money and the ladies and the cars and he's 5'7". And I also wanted to be like you know, someone who's, you know, successful and who's also short. Because it's just so cool when you see like a super mega star on TV, right? And with all the explosions and stuff, when you see him in, in real life, he's like shorter than you. That's like mind blowing, right? You expect to see Arno or The Rock, right? All tall and shit. Even Clinton, you're like all oh, tall. Right? Lincoln, all oh, tall, right? That's like a given. They're from the TV. They should be tall, bigger than life. But then when you see them in real life, it's like Tom Cruise, five six and a half. And you're like, what the fuck, right? Then that's like that's that's cool, you know? That's like, you no, know, that's that's just cool, you know? That's even more bigger than life because it's shorter than what you expect him to be. So that's what my obsession with being short. So at that time, I wanted people to perceive me as shorter than what I really am. So. I sort of shrunk myself a little bit and listed myself with uh, five and three quarters. And uh, that leads me to the second question of all, second most asked question of all time. Frank, can you dunk a basketball? I'm gonna do my squat and after the set I'll tell you. I'm listing myself officially now as 5'10 is because I'm over that being short face so I want I want you to perceive me as being tall now. So I'm not really 5'10 and I'm really not 5'8. So you do the math, you know? Right. Okay, last question of the day. At my last video this guy made a comment and he was like, Frank, you're um Videos are all really inspiring, and uh, I come here to see bodybuilding stuff, right? And I have so much respect for you. But then sometimes you pull out shit like that, like you talk about dreams in your mom, and, and, and you eat dead fish, and you take bath with like household cleaning supplies, and I lost respect for you. And what's up with that, Frank? Uh, my response, well, uh, I know how you feel, bro, because uh, sometimes when I'm having sex with my girlfriend, and like, her like stomach and pussy just rips apart and then Z's comes out of it in blood and gore and all gooey and stuff like that and he's like you mad brah and he start flexing at me licking his bicep and then I'm like son I'm disappointed and then I lost respect I don't know for Z's or for my girlfriend I'm not sure but I know how you feel bro I'm in the same boat Please, Frank. 
Don't fuck with people's presumptions. And please, don't break the bodybuilding stereotype.